the screen about Kerala healthcare uh, that's in fact uh, making an aggressive move uh, uh, and uh, is, uh, is is buying uh, some of the of the drugs uh, uh, that's of course to strengthen its presence in India close after announcing its deal yesterday but they we now learn that they are acquiring eight brands uh, Vikas Dandekar is uh, back with us now uh, our old friend uh, uh, Dandy as we know him uh, Vikas uh, you know, of course, you're always part of CNBC TV 18 family and uh, good to have you back on air. Uh, uh, tell us, uh, it's, it's your first story since you've come back. Uh, take us through this. Thank you. Thank you so much, uh, Anuj. It's good to be back here in the family. Um, so, uh, you know, on Zydus Cadilla, the company has been a very cautious acquirer. I mean, it doesn't do many deals, but if it does deals, it really looks at the valuations uh, very closely and what could be the potential of market uh, growth for the brands or the company that it acquires. So uh, uh, we have confirmed information from AstraZeneca that uh, Zytus Cadillac has acquired uh, eight of its brands uh, in India. Uh, these brands have uh, been uh, low uh, priority for AstraZeneca, but uh, doesn't mean that it doesn't have growth potential. And Zytus Cadillac has been uh, extremely uh, aggressive in acquiring brands which uh, probably are low priority yet have a, gro a good growth potential in the Indian market. So uh, all of these brands, I mean, some are actually for uh, uh, cough, congestion, uh, neurology, uh, some some of them are for hormones uh, also. So all of it have come to Zytus Cadillac at a very low valuation and plus it has not got the uh, field force also so all that, that it has done it has acquired it has acquired the brands only and all of these will probably help Cadilla in uh, growing its uh, uh, market share within the Indian territory. 